Okay, friends, welcome back to the wasteland. I always try to sound upbeat when, uh, when realizing we're in a horrible, horrible situation. <clears throat> What's up with the audio these days? The audio is a little bit off. Let's see. That sounds much better. So. We need to go here to, what was this, to the western field, east field, sorry. If memory serves, there were one or two little locations that we couldn't get past because of the overgrowth the last time we were here. So, because we need to be complete and thorough. Nothing left unlooted. It's absolutely my approach to these types of games. Gotta get that, get that gear. So it was either in this building or there was another one where there was some overgrowth happening. That wasn't here, it was the other building. So I think we are pretty much done here at the Ag Center. We've shut down the east and west fields. Now we need to retrace our steps there's a couple of safes that i need a rose to hack f into for us and we need to be given our rewards by the director of the center yep we, we got in there where was it that i was thinking that we needed to go still oh, okay looks like we've been everywhere here Maybe it was along here. Mind is playing tricks on me. Okay, so it looks like we've cleared everything out. Okay. Never mind. Also, I think once we finish in the egg center, we go back to the, to the citadel. They'll actually let us into the citadel for the first time. And I'm hoping that all the money from the Ag Center that we get from the rewards will let us get some upgraded weapons. What I really want is an upgraded SMG because this little greaser we've got is rubbish. As far as upgraded heavy weapons are concerned, we've already got the M2, which does surprisingly good damage considering it's just a little tier one weapon. But I think it's unrealistic to expect that we can buy ourselves a tier 2 heavy weapon. We'll just have to rely on, on, on finding that out, out in, the, in the field. Done that room. Okay, we, we are done down here. We've done the mushroom caves. We've done that wing as well. go talk to the, to the director lady. I think she's going to give us the cure, which we then need to pour into a reservoir in that part of the map. And then we still have to go here, take on those rabbits. Wild rabbits. It was easy once I figured out the pods were mutated fungal spores. All we need is a fungicide, and fortunately, there's a bunch of the stuff in the mushroom caves in the basement. Bring me some, and I can make a serum that'll cure Matt and any of you who are infected. I have a fungicide. Thank God, you're just in time. Give it to me and wait right here. Matt, your case is very acute. I'm going to have to inject a high concentration dose directly into your veins. Kathy, I... I don't... I don't think... Shut up and give me your arm. I... I can feel it working. Hurts, but it's better. Better. Th thank you, Kathy. Thank you, recruits. I I'm, I'm gonna need some more time on the sidelines, but I, I think... I think I'm gonna make it. Thank you, Rangers. If you have a sec, I have one more request for you. You'll be especially interested if any of you caught the infection. Yep, a few of us have. Uh, can we buy stuff from Matt Forrestal yet? I'm doing Hanging in there. 
Hey there, kids. Watching you on the security cameras. You were really going above and beyond for my people, and you sure as hell saved my ass. I can't thank you enough. Except a promise I'll put in a good word with Vargas. Oh, and if you head to my office, I got some supplies for you. Thank the you. The door. Check the safe. Use eight zero zero eight five. Boobs, classic. Up. Mine is the first door on the left through the west hall. That one. You have any supplies? Okay, so sell junk. Let's see, sell everybody's weapons. I think we will break those down. Armor will keep ammo we need desperately. I need to I need to buy more. Five five six. Misc items. So here's where we can sell and make money. So these pants and legs don't actually do anything armor wise, I don't think. Gorilla legs, gorilla top, gorilla mask. Okay, someone is going to dress up as a gorilla, that's for sure. Military pack doesn't actually do anything. The guano will save. Ruined overalls we can sell. I certainly don't need both Akita figurines that we hand in and the poop we all hand in at the Citadel. Oof, look at that. It's still not actually that great. I think I want to buy that scorpion when we get back to the Citadel. Another leather jacket is tempting. But what we need is all of us 556. Five, and 31 rounds of 336 is fine. I think we'll take... Is this sell? We have all that shotgun ammo. Fuck, sell all that. I don't need all that. Let's keep 10 rounds of shotgun ammo. I know that Rose's gun uses shotgun ammo. And we'll hang on to a total of 40 energy cells. So we'll sell like another 11. Okay, give me all your 38 ammo. And we still have a thousand squad scrap. Thanks Thank for you. coming by, Rangers. Always good to see new recruits taking their first steps into the big wide world. Okay, Spunkmeyer. I think it's time we dress you up like a gorilla. Because because reasons. This is a very important tactical decision to make you look like a gorilla. And where was that spare gun? We should have Angela break it down. Oh, actually, hmm. Well, we'll, we'll see what Rose can uh, she can get from it because I think it'll be just scrap parts. Sturdy bag, maybe. Fine. The temptation was to give him a second pistol, so when this one's empty, you just uh, quick switches to it. <laughs> Bunkmire, you look fucking ridiculous. I love it. <laughs> Miss Bunkmire, me shoot with SMG. Me leader of group. Copy, Echo One. Yeah, congratulations, Echo. Me level up, me very smart. No perk points, no attribute points. Extra point in submachine gun, I think. What was Pawner again? It was 20% more scrap from selling junk. That's an excellent trait. I think we'll, we'll, we'll get fast reload as a perk and then I'm going to go all the way into barter. I'm very curious to see in the long run how worth it that is. I have an intuition it might not be that worth it, but what the hell, why not? And it's kind of like non-typical, you know? Uh, leadership. 
not too convinced by that. So th this thing has still got an explosive on it, doesn't it? Even though we were given a key. So do I have to take off the explosives or just by using the key is it gonna uh, disable the explosives? Matt's office key. I think it's going to explode in my face. And I needed to take off the explosives first. Okay, that's interesting. So that's how it works. All right. History of the egg center. This must be Matt's office. Oops. Man after my own heart. Another M2. Matt Forrestal's badge. Not great, actually. Really, that M2 is just going to give us more weapon parts, but... So now this is that other chick's office. We break in here. I think we should. shouldn't be in here. This is Catherine's office. Private. Ooh. Well, we're saving her and her ass, so I think this is a fair exchange. Holding out on us. And look at the state of her office. It's disgusting. Let me clean up in here. So that M40 may well be worth upgrading. Let's just compare the numbers. Whoopsie. 16 to 20. Oh yeah, that's way better. Let's go ahead and upgrade that. So what can it take? It can take a short barrel, which I don't think I want to do. Under barrel, flashlight, a scope and a mag. So maximum range is how far? 32 meters. If I chuck on the short barrel, it comes 28 meters, which is still plenty. All it needs now is a scope and it'll be fully kitted out. Nice. Use it well, pendant blade. Any other spare weapons? Yes, there was this M2. We can break down all this stuff. I'm just thinking, why am I carrying this nail board? I, I don't know where this Pugmire was actually going to get blunt weapons. I think he was going to be one of the energy weapon guys. And can Rose's thorn be broken down? I wonder... Okay, it can't even be handed off. Grip tape, nice. That's plus to hit chance. Oh, minus attack AP, awesome. Once potato fish gets an improved bladed weapon. I mean, technically the sickle is an attack, an improved bladed weapon, but I think we can do better than that. That's 3.1 damage per AP, which is not wonderful. So looking at all of these upgrades we got here, I want to spend all of this money that we have on, on buying improved weapons. Another sturdy mag, another underbarrel flashlight, high cap mag, we'll chuck that onto the SMG. Good stuff. Yes, I, I kind of forgot what it was I was supposed to be doing. Uh, oh yes, I need to talk to this chick here. Got to hand it to you. Yes, Rangers. thank you, Ray. Not to mention, if any of you You're got really blasted by a pod, then spreading the through cure through people. the complex will get enough medicine in your system to clear you up. Cure Ag Center, cure yourself. 
Sure thing. To do that, we need to add one dose of the serum to the nutrient reservoir tanks in the east greenhouse, just down the hall from here. If she hasn't already, Rose can give you the airlock code. What do you say? Oh, hell yes. Wait, here's five doses of the serum I made from the fungicide. I'm giving you extra in case the infection has somehow spread outside. Now, you could use mm. the serum directly on yourselves. It might have some vivifying properties, but the rangers wouldn't be selfish like that, would they? Uh, by the way, Lawson intentionally started the outbreak. Then he exploded. I mean, technically, we exploded him, but, you know. I know. I saw on the monitors. I still can't believe it. He was one of us. He... but... But maybe it does make a certain twisted sense. He's been spending more and more time working down in the mushroom caves. He said he was working on fungal-based medicines. But, but why? Why would anyone do this? I don't understand. Uh, we need to do the signal, but that's just going to piss her off Ranger asking about it. Let's go cure the, the, the egg center first. Ryan, he made it out. Good. Grief stricken and wrecked with tears, Ryan stands over the body of his dear Rachel. She's dead, Rangers. She's dead. What am I going to do? Smart ass. By the way, Ryan, Larson started the outbreak. What? No, he, uh, I wanted to protest, but for some reason I know you're telling the truth. He was always a little off, aloof, friendly, but never warm. I always knew he was holding something back. I just could have guessed. I don't want to hear about Rachel. Tough shit. Sorry, buddy. Hey, lucky crit indeed. That sickle is pretty cool. I'll give it that much. Technically, I probably should have kicked that open. I could have got an extra bit of XP out of it. Place the cure in the intake valve, and Ag Center is saved. Well done, Rangers. Thank you, Rose. Ooh. Range chance to hit bonus. Who do we give that to? Angela. Lab coat. Transmorpher. Okay, is that it as far as looting is concerned? Pour the serum? Yes. Nice. Pour the serum into the reservoir and here the pumps start to flush it through the system. Are your eyes playing tricks on you or do the plants already seem to be receding? I think now we can ask her about this bloody signal dish. I wonder if those rabbits we would have to have fought are still going to be aggro. You're really... Thank you, we owe you our lives and our livelihood. And the region owes you too. If Ag Center had been ruined, Everyone from High Pool to Ranger Center would have been starving within a week. You have our deepest gratitude. Okay, so we're investigating a distant signal and need to use your radio dish. Can you tell us where it is? Sure. Go knock yourself out. The radio dish is in the West Greenhouse on the other side of this floor. Ask Rose for the airlock codes if you have them. Oh, before Goodbye. you go, I thought you might be interested in a few supplies I dug up while I was researching the cure. Now that the crisis is over, we can start replenishing our Sun store rooms, and I think you may need it even more than us. You tend to end up in situations with a high chance of grievous bodily harm, it would seem. Take care. See you Thank around. Thank you, Kathy. Bless you. So, I saw that we got an umbrella, but I missed what the other thing was, if there was a second thing. Max water carry capacity. Equip. Fire tread breastplate, lab coat. This tiny robot seems to transform into a pickup truck. What kind of wizardry is this? <laughs> Exit a serum. Oh yes, we're gonna have to use that to treat the areas where those uh, infected pigeons went out to. Okay, already got that. I'm pretty sure Pendant Blade can't equip the monocle. 
she's an ascetic. So we give it to Waitress. He's got Animal Whisperer. We can switch out back to the Akita figurine when he ne needs to actually tame an animal. Oh wait, Rose. I could have given it to Rose. Yeah, so we've done this. Ooh, wait a second. Have I done this correctly? Yes! Nice! Okay, so usually... Well, in the previous playthrough, the mistake I made was I came here before fixing the egg center, then the pod explodes, destroying the safe. But now, after doing the serum, the pod just pops uh, harmlessly. And we get nice, more grip tape, another Akita figurine. I'm glad I waited before I came here. Oh, we got a level up. Copy Echo One. Congratulations. Uh, no perks or character points. Lock picking, safe mm, brawling. Eight skill points available, holy crap. So, Pendant Blade is pretty much sorted for Sniper Rifle. I want to see what Confidence Shooter, shooter and Focus Shooter gives though. And I wonder if you have to take all of them. Confidence Shooter, a Focus Shooter. Oh, it upgrades itself, I see. Okay, so minus 15 under pressure penalty. It's not that great. And then you've got Zen Shooter and Dead Eye. Zen Shooter, minus 45, okay, fine. And then I'm guessing Dead Eye is going to remove the under pressure penalty entirely. It's kind of situational because, I mean, as long as you set up your squad properly, that shouldn't be a problem. Minus one action point cost when firing sniper rifles if you haven't moved during a combat turn. That's really good. What I will probably try at a later point is, I'm not going to bother with Confident and Zen Shooter, but once we hit level 10, we'll take straight Deadeye and see whether I have to pick up those perks to be able to get that uh, level five, level 10 one. And that, that's Pendant Blade for a bit now, because she gets four skill points every level, and this one will take eight. So we will keep doing lock picking, safe cracking, alarm disarming. If we scanned everything here, we have... Who's that? Snake squeezing is all I have left. Oh, this is the dude we rescued from the mushroom caves. I know the codes, Rangers. We'll be inside momentarily. Rangers, I see one of our animal researchers, Julio, near the radio dish. This here we go. Pops uh, helplessly as I expected. Yes, it looks like the rabbits are still dangerous. Big nasty pointy teeth. I could have sworn it said that there was an explosive there or something. Okay. Polaroids and some ammo. How best do we fight these rabbits? I think the way we fought them last time was actually pretty Julio, good. Is that you? He's been cornered <coughs> by his own rabbits. I think they're going to eat him. Hang in there, Julio. He'll be just grand. Don't worry about it. Sniper rifle at the back here. We'll open up with a sniper rifle, that's for sure.
I think it's worth shooting with a heavy rifle. A heavy weapon, I mean. These rabbits are friggin' nasty. 16 to 20 damage. I wonder if I shouldn't go for the pod. Nah. Missed. 75 missed. Fucking rabbits, man. I want to see what the percentage chance is to use Animal Whisperer. I guess I should have shot the pod and got the explosion damage. Get him, Angela. Nice hit. Hundred percent. Sweet. Oh, so it just runs off. Ah, that is so much better than fighting them. We gotta save that guy. Wow, that was cool. So briefly, I was thinking that, hey, we need to also stock up big time on medkits and ammo back at the Citadel, but we're still sitting on, what, 14 medkits? Plus whatever we can scrounge from the environment, so that's not too bad. Which is all great news, because it means there's more money freed up to be buying big old weapons. Julio, aren't you okay? Rose, you love my rabbits. How could you let them do that? I'm sorry, Julio, it had to be done. They weren't rabbits anymore. I... I suppose it had to be done, but I raised those rabbits since they were kits and... Oh hell, I'm sorry. Thank you for saving my life. You must be the rangers, Kathy called after the madness started. Matt said you were on your way. Is there some place safe to hide until it's over? Uh, we cleared a path. You can escape. How about the kitchen? Okay, I'll hold up there. Have you found Doc Larson yet? Everybody you save is probably going to be wounded, so you're going to need him. Larson intentionally started the outbreak, then he exploded. I don't think this is the time for black humor, Rangers. But you're serious, aren't you? That means he's responsible for my rabbits, that bastard. I hope you're all Goodbye. right, Julio. That must have been heartbreaking for you. Well, this is it. Hope it was worth all your trouble. <laughs> cool! With the hydraulic plants cleared away, the enormous hydraulics below the dish grown to life. Ranger Team Echo, this is Ranger Command. Are you reading me? Affirmative, Roger Command. We read you, Lima Charlie. Roger, Echo One. We just received the Ag Center relay signal. Looks like everything's hooked up correctly. We should be. The gift I want to pass on to you. The weak, the downtrodden, the persecuted and enslaved. Come to the new citadel, join our brotherhood, and you too will wear the armor of the evolved. You too will be immortal, invulnerable, untouched by disease or age for all time. You will be a perfect being, ready to lead the world into a golden future of light, beauty, and per God's mercy is in the bullets of our guns, brothers and sisters. It is in the tips of our bayonets. It is in the death of every sinner who is too blind to turn to the light. Every time we end a life in this God-forsaken world, we end misery and bring peace. So, I say unto you, friends, 
Praise the Lord. Damn it, Woodson. I did not want that to go out over the air. Uh, sorry about that, Echo One. Uh, good job. You're halfway there. Please proceed to High Pool ASAP. We are still getting SOS calls from that location. Again, deal with the emergency first, the radio tower second. Copy? Copy that. Roger, Echo One. Level ups. Copy, Echo One. Congratulations, Echo One. Okay, animal whisper sitting at four, that's really good. Yeah, keep improving that. Uh, well, we can't, we have to save those. Out of interest, what is zero? 2% stacking critical chance bonus when repeatedly attacking a target with handguns. Bonus lost when switching to another target. It's not great, actually. 21% crit chance is already quite high. This is the issue with these lads, they are only going to level up every two levels. Oh well. That's that done. We've got a little bit more to clean up on this part of the map, with the egg center. Let's get out of here. Oh no, hang on, we didn't go through here. Should be an entrance this way. It's like lose or something here. Yeah, toilets. Ugh, more? Really? Come on, give us a good weapon. Upgraded SMG, here we go. A mangler, that's good. That's gonna come in handy in the next boss fight. Okay, so we've been through here. So there are the, just the, there's the two safes outside that Rose needs to hack, and then we're done at the Ag Center. Now, do we go straight to Harpool, or should we pop in at the Citadel and go do some shopping? Um, I think we can go straight to Harpool because. We can do shopping here. You helped my people when no one else could. Save me from a fate I'd rather not imagine. Hope whatever you got from my things. So, all junk. Now I must just decide whether I want to buy some more armor. Thanks for coming by, Rangers. Always good to so see new leather jacket there. I've got three armor and three armor. So I, uh, hmm, I was gonna say it, it, I feel like Pendant Blade doesn't need the armor that much because she should be standing back with a heavy weapon. But I do think Pendant Blade needs the armor. Fish, sorry. 121 goat hide armor. See, it slows down combat speed though. And leather jacket doesn't, so we'll just buy another, another leather jacket if we can. Always good to see new recruits taking their first steps into the big wide world. I think we go back to the Citadel. Actually, no, we, we, we were ordered to go to Harpool, so we'll go to we'll, we'll, we'll go to Harpool. We're good little boys who it follow orders. It pains me to see the grounds this way. We do so much good here.
Nice. On the brink of getting two more level ups as well. That actually reminds me, I need to stop in at the original uh, radio tower location because there is that little synthetic robot that we need to hack into. So maybe we'll stop in there and any of the infected villages before we go to High Pool. Whatever's on the way. Basically, let's not delete any. No lollygagging. into the that's safe already i think that's it that is the egg center done let's fill up with some water get out of here great job everyone great job So, high pool is right there. So I reckon we'll go high pool, radio tower, back down, infected village, infected, infected, and then back to Rangers Citadel. Eighty water, good. That's loads of water. You see what looks like a traveling vendor? Yes, please. I have a thousand scrap burning a hole in my wallet, and I want to buy weapons. Wastelander, welcome, don't be shy. I have everything you need to survive. Check my fair prices. You travel a lot, where's the best place to cool your heels? Oh sweet, a shrine. What are you selling? Amazing weapons! Oh my god! <gasps> Look at it, Max 17! 23 to 26 times 4, that's 100 damage per burst. Thirty-one forty-four sniper rifle. A FAMAS. Okay, so let's look at the damage per AP numbers. 6.3, 10 point, that's fucking incredible. 16, okay, we, we have to buy that max 17. 5.7. A night stick. A PP eighty one. Spunk Meyer. Max seventeen. Use it well, my friend. That is such a big uh, improvement. Is there not a heavy weapon that I can buy here? It's bladed. Only 287, an M24. How does that compare to Potato Fisher's sniper rifle? Wow, shit. And I already went and upgraded the M40. Well, we can't afford that, anyways. 493. I could go for the Midnight Special, and maybe while selling some other stuff, we can pick up the pickaxe as well. Bladed weapon, hatchet, wow. 6.1, 10.5, 12.5. Wow. damage per AP, that's an incredible blunt weapon. Okay, midnight special. Oh, baby. And increased crit chance. So I think we're going to sell that. I mean, I'm tempted to keep it as a secondary, but I want to see whether I can get that pickaxe as well. Max 17. A compact set machine gun that fires the heavier. Oh, shit. I didn't realize. That's why it does so much damage. Uh, 
I think I might have stupidly upgraded a level one basic rifle. What are the remove upgrade chances here? Fifty percent chance to destroy all this stuff. Junk. Don't have any junk. Can sell the greaser. Hunting rifle can sell. That we can sell. That we can sell. I'm gonna hang on to my two laser weapons. I'm not using any shotgun shells, so that can be sold. Grip type. We're only using bladed weapons for one person. We're not like, open up, but Angela has a blunt weapon we can upgrade. I need all this stuff, frankly. That can be sold. Lab coat can sell. All these Ranger stars we don't need. Four thirty-nine. How much do we need? I'm tempted to buy that M16. What's an M14? Is it? Uh, airlock codes. Crippled post-it notes. Whose are these? Oh, that's rubbish, we'll sell that. Hmm. Uh, oh, the shotguns are actually great. M16, assault rifle. Five hundred and four. We are so close. Maybe if I sell the sickle, I can afford the hatchet on potato fish. Four seventy four, and we need five oh four. So we need thirty. What's this worth? Forty six. Sell it. Awesome. Okay, so we broke, but we got ourselves a nice little upgrade of weapons here. In fact, give that to Angela so she can chuck the grip tape on it. Attach mod to the hatchet. Fuck yeah! Even weights as well. Otherwise known as a utility axe, perfect for everything on your chopping list. There's more grip tape, isn't there? We can chuck the grip tape onto your uh, hatchet. We just find it. Oh, that's badass. And 30% critical chance. It's really high. I'm just gutted. I chucked all those upgrades onto the M40. not do the kind of damage I was hoping for. Anyway, I can't wait to see this Mac 17. Oh, fuck, I forgot to buy ammo for it. Pish. Classic stobby maneuver. I've just gone and bought him a weapon that I can't afford. How much do we have? 16. So I can buy him eight rounds. Gotta be something else we can justify selling. So let's let's sell f mm, thirty nine of these and leave ourselves with like just twenty rounds. Uh, open choke. That can be sold. We're never going to be using shotguns, I don't think, in this in this playthrough. I don't know what the cigarettes do, so I'm happy to sell them. Okay, how much can I afford here? Yep, 
Excellent. Oh, who's carrying the fucking M40 caliber rounds? That's 9 mil ammo. Oh, for God's sake. You see, it's my attention to detail that uh, makes me so good at this game. Six rounds. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, Spunk Maya. Sorry, dude. I've already screwed you over there. So this is an interesting issue now that I've leveled myself into. I kind of need to go into a secondary weapon now. Because he's got no rounds. And his submachine gun. I could go into energy weapons. Fuck. Oh my god, I screwed that up completely. Really embarrassing. This is awkward! Welp. That's gonna hurt Spunkmire's damage output. I really hope we can uh, scavenge. Attack the Raiders. Let's hope they bring us some 40 cal ammo. Yeah, where are these nerds? There they are. Oh! Spotted us! Oh, I didn't see that guy, damn. What's he got? An SMG. Oh, Jesus. Rail thief. Rail thief gunner. Whoa, nice damage. Do I want to close into that lad? What is he using? That's an assault rifle. I'm just going to have her run up and try to smash him. Also, because that's going to put pressure on him. And same thing here, actually. Whoa! 62 damage! Good lord, what a crit. Let's get in there and do some punching. I do not think it is worth spending AP, or spending ammo certainly, to kill these dudes. Oh shit, I've left the of fish out in the open. And that was a point blank... Uh. Oh, thank goodness. Need to work on my combat. The difference in damage is really noticeable when you upgrade the weapons. Of 10 to 15 damage is actually pretty friggin' good. Railroad spike. M4 carbine. Whoa! No wonder he did so much damage. No, the M4 is way better. Mm. 
What else can it take? Steady mag. Awesome. And that reminds me, I can ink and add a high cap mag. It's already got a 30 round capacity. I wonder if that's even worth it. It shoots four. It doesn't need the high cap mag. It needs a sturdy mag. We'll still give it the under barrel flashlight though. I think a sniper rifle will do well with that. Plus four capacity. 50 round capacity, that's already got plenty. Where'd my gun go? What happened? Did I drop it on the floor accidentally, I think? Oh, there it is. points available uh, at the next level glancing strikes but I don't actually have any perk points available so yep just keep upgrading your primary damage source handguns field medic handguns so how does this Marikov compare the Midnight Special is way better, but I think Rose would benefit from the Marikov. 10 to 15, yeah, way better. Ah, oh, that's better. I need to think of something to give to Spunkmeyer for a second weapon. I want him to have energy weapons, but he really can't use that right now. I've just completely gimped him by getting this ammo wrong. Honestly, it never occurred to me that a Max 17 would use 40 caliber ammo. Silly, 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 silly. Still, I can't wait to see Angela go to work with this M. What's his M4? M4 carbine. And for just a random raider encounter, nice rewards, man. Awesome. Uh, not that way, apparently. Back to where we came? Question mark. Yes, back to where we came. Okay friends, so here we are. Ready to go to High Pool. That was an interesting episode. I love the fact that we got Im improved weapons, even if I totally fucked up and didn't let Spunk Meyer uh, actually have <laughs> the ammo to use it. When we come back, we'll dive into high pool. See how it goes. This is the Wasteland. I'm Stobby One for Nine. Thanks for watching, friends. I'll see you guys next time.